Hello and welcome to Eating a Fisherman's Basket. Um, it's a classic meal from, you can find it at most fish and chip shops. Um, some of them are a bit sneaky and put it under a different name. Sometimes they call it seafood platter, various other names, but um, you're not fooling anyone. It's a fisherman's basket, okay? Uh, they, they change from shop to shop, but um, basically the same sort of deal, just a bed of chips and then you've you've got a selection from the ocean really really great meal so I've just gone to my local uh, fish and chip shop up at Pinelands Plaza Sunnyman Kills and I'm got myself a fisherman's basket that I'm that I'm gonna be eating so alright we'll, we'll just open this up here and have a look we've got um, a bit of everything from the ocean got a seafood stick there Got some seafood circles, and then um, the fish, apparently. So yeah, calamari. A few of them do. Um, few of them do salad these, these days, just to sort of balance it out. So you're getting a getting a bit of everything, surf and turf, if you will. So let's eat it, eh? Good. Um, Got a tartar sauce they put in there for a bit of add a bit of flavour and, and a bit of lemon. We'll, we'll spread out a bit of lemon just to give it a bit of bit of zest. There we go. What do you reckon? Oh, start of a prawn cutlet. These are great. Excellent, excellent part of the, the fisherman's basket. And I've got a um Got a classic beverage to wash this down today, the the Kirk's Creaming Soda. Really, really great beverage there, so nice and tasty. Good stuff. Um, this one's a bit interesting. I think that's the seafood scallop. So it's an interesting taste, we'll give that a go. Look, it's not my favourite part of the fisherman's basket, but still, it's still alright. It's it's good. Calamari, you got you gotta love a good calamari. Just really great taste. If you you have a few chips. Every now and then, because there's a lot, of, a lot of chips to get through, so you gotta, gotta have a few chips in between each, each um, seafood item. Now, always, um, always trying to. It's always a hard decision what you're going to put your tartar sauce on, because sometimes you get a, a really big serving, but you don't always. So, like today, I've just got one of these small. Um, Small squeeze sachets, so I'll probably put on the fish because a bit of tartar sauce on the fish goes down well. There we go. Haven't used it all, so I'll leave a bit for later. I'm not sure what the um, species of fish it is, but there's a there's a little creek behind the shop, so I wouldn't be surprised if they've um, thrown the rod out there and brought it in so I find it's best not to think about where where the items of the fisherman's basket have been sourced from. It's not not necessary, just just to eat it and enjoy it I reckon. It's a good meal. Um bit of the salad, not too bad. You can't, you can't really expect a fish and chip shop to, to be making really good salad, you know, so it is what it is, you know, and this is my, this is one of my favourite parts of the pack, you know, the seafood stick. Very rarely will you find a, a bad seafood stick, it's, it just doesn't happen, you can always rely on the seafood stick, so. 
Um, then I've got, I've only got the uh, seafood circle. Give that a go. Yeah, that, that's a nice seafood circle. Really good. So, um, there you have it, a, a sort of taking you through the fisherman's basket. Um, do yourself a favour and head down to your local fish and chip shop and and uh, try try to eat one because they're pretty good. Okay, we'll see you later. Bye.